Hey Leo, welcome to my channel. So today I have a collective message. We're going to find out what spirit wants you to hear. Please remember this may not resonate for every Leo. This also could resonate for your sun, moon, rising or Venus. And this is timeless. So let's get straight into this Leo and find out what spirit wants you to know. Okay, Leo. Um, so there's definitely a lot going on here. There's a lot of new beginnings happening for you. Um, I am getting that you're in this energy of receiving and you have the Eight of Cups here, which is a brand new beginning in love, okay, a new chapter with somebody, um, and then you have the Eight of Swords here, which is communication, okay? So, there is somebody new coming into your life, and they are here to offer you everything that you've been manifesting, right? And I am getting that this person, they're coming in with clear communication. And again, this is somebody that... It's like you've been manifesting them. They present as everything that you need. Now, I do see that this is not a new person, but this is a new connection, right? This is somebody that has been working up the courage for a very long time to try to make some type of move towards you, Leo. They feel like... They haven't really known how to approach you and I am getting that in the past there was no communication here between you two but now this person is opening up, they are being honest. And you may be surprised because this person they actually do have a lot of options, okay, they're very popular but the thing is they're very focused on you. They love the way that you carry yourself. They feel like they're actually a little bit intimidated by you because they feel like that you get a lot of attention, right? Even though they get a lot of attention, they're intimidated by the fact that you get a lot of attention as well. And this person, they also feel like you get a lot of attention, but you... You're very selective, right? Even though you have a lot of people trying to access you, you have a lot of people trying to get into your energy, Leo, it's very hard to actually get into your energy. Like, you tend to have very strong boundaries. It's like everybody wants to know you, but you don't want to know everybody, right? You actually seem to be somebody that you have very strong boundaries. You don't just give your energy to anyone. And this person really adores that about you. I do see that there's been something in the way between you two for a while. And there actually could be a difference, okay? For some of you, there's an age difference between you two. This person could be a little bit younger than you. Or there even could be a difference in religion, right? But there definitely seems to be some type of difference here that has actually been stopping this connection and stopping this person from coming forward. You could be dealing with a Taurus. You could be dealing with an Aries. So I see this person, as I mentioned, they were very intimidated by you. Um, this person's been working on themselves. They have actually been bettering themselves so they can become the best versions of themselves, okay? for you. Now this is somebody when you met them they had no control over their life okay they didn't have like 
a routine. Um, this person was not in a good place financially. But now I do see them bettering themselves. They're in some type of habit that they have put an end to. Wow, okay. You have, like, people fighting for your attention, Leo, okay? Um, with, whether you know it or not, you literally have these people here, like, trying to get your attention. Um, I'm just getting, like, people are very full on here. You have a lot of people in your energy, But I'm getting that these people, they don't want to treat you right. I am getting that this person is like mad about the way people are approaching you. I'm getting that people are approaching you in... A very, okay, so there's two people here. Now, one of them is being very full on, okay. Um, there's a lot of, like, sexual energy that they have toward you and they're being very full on, okay. They're really trying to, like, get with you. And then there's another one here who, they're not and full on but they're definitely very honest and open and very aggressive right so both of these people have feelings here for you and they feel like whoever this person is that's been holding back they feel like they couldn't really make a move because you have so many people already in your face right And you seem to be avoiding, like, all of these people. You're not really interested in any of these people that are in your faith, right? Now, I do see that, again, there is an attraction to this other person that's avoiding you. <sighs> that was a love card. It really wanted to come out. Um, this person, they're avoiding you. They... They do not want to approach you the way that other people are approaching you, okay? They really do have, like, real-life feelings for you. And they want to kind of approach you in a more respectful way, right? They cannot stand how other people around you are not being respectful to you. They feel like they are being very full-on and overstepping your boundary, okay, um, they feel like that these people are being immature and they're not, like, they, they don't understand you, this person feels like they understand you, and they feel like you are a very spiritual being, and they feel like that they need to approach you with respect, and they're angry because other people are not doing that, but they feel like they cannot really say anything or do anything about it. The amount of attention that you're getting, Leo, is crazy, okay? You could be dealing with the Gemini. You could be dealing with another Leo that can't get energy here too. And Capricorn. So I do say that you don't even see this person as a potential love interest because they tend to not they haven't made any move like they haven't made any moves at all they have been very quiet they've been watching and they've been waiting and they've been analyzing the situation 
unlike other people, okay, then other people that they're very like full on when it comes to you. They really just want to be around you. I just need 10, 10. They really just want to be in your energy. Um, they tend to be very full on. And yeah, I'm getting that you have these people literally crossing your boundaries and disrespecting you. And that is the biggest turn off for you. Like I'm getting that these people, you're not even interested in them because of the way that they're approaching you and they literally have you all wrong. And you actually are more interested in this other person because they are being more respectful. This is somebody that's watching and waiting and wants to approach you in the right way and at the right time. So you are very intuitive, okay? And this person, they're trying to be very, like, subtle. But you can really see through them, Leo. Like, you know this person's avoiding you. You know this person's not making a move. You know this because they are intimidated and they are waiting for the right time. But they really think that, you know, they're playing it cool. They really think that you have no idea, right? But here's the thing as well, Leo, this person, they have really put you on a pedestal and actually you have a lot of people here that have put you on the pedestal, Leo. You have a lot of people here that it's like the way that they treat you, it's like you're a celebrity or something, right? But here's the thing, this person doesn't even know what they would do with you. They do not even know what they would do with you, to be honest, right? They feel like they're very, like, mediocre when it, like, compared to you, right? They feel like you are so interesting, you have so many hobbies, you're so gifted. And they feel like they're just so plain and boring. And that's just how they feel. They feel like they don't even know how they're going to handle you. Like, yeah, this would be great. But they don't know, again, how to handle you. They are really judging this situation harshly. And they have been closed off emotionally. They really just have lost hope in this connection altogether, but I do see them just being straightforward. There's something that happened to this person that caused them to... Before, it's like their ego was in the way and they were not approaching you because, you know, their ego was in the way, but now they've had some type of ego death and it's like they just they don't care anymore they just want to make some type of move here and again there is this fear that you're not even going to be interested in them but again they do want to make some type of move okay leo so expect movement from this person expect communication from this person and again it might be very unexpected because they have been acting for the longest time that they are not interested. Okay? So that's all I have for you, Leo. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.